Good afternoon, gents. I'm Ollie. It's Make Me That Guy. And the subject of today's video is six signs that a woman is attracted to you, that she likes you, that she wants you. Okay, so if you're seeing these signs, you're not reading them properly, then you might not be making the move and you might be losing chicks. And no one wants to lose chicks, do they? All right, so gentlemen, here we go. Sign number one, that a woman is possibly attracted to you. Okay, so probably the most obvious sign and a bit of a cliche, and if you don't know this, then come on, open your eyes, right, is when women play with their hair and touch their hair. So like, oh, right, yeah, hmm, that kind of thing, and grooming themselves. So hyper-accentuated grooming when you seem to turn up, right? I've even seen guys walk past, there's been a hot girl there, she's obviously interested, and she turns away and quickly looks in the mirror or gets her phone out and starts looking and doing her hair, or just subconsciously touching it up and playing with it. So it can be either when she sees him approaching, looking at her look in the mirror, or actually during conversation, like I was doing just now, more little touches and nervous kind of adjustments to the hair, right? This can also be done with the clothes as well, pulling them into shape, catching her reflection, what she's basically doing is making sure she looks hot shit because she finds you attractive and she wants to be at her best. So be aware that if she has no interest, then subconsciously she wouldn't be thinking, mm, how's my hair? So usually that is a sign that she's feeling your vibes and maybe it's time to make the move. Okay, number two must be proximity, i.e. invading your personal space. Okay, this is especially so with a girl you might meet in a club or a social atmosphere, okay? If they tend to lean in and invade that kind of, you know, this kind of distance, then that's far too close. As humans, we're very used to having our own realm of our personal space. And if someone invades it without permission or someone you don't know, you'll feel threatened instantly. Okay, so it's actually a very unnatural thing to do to move too close to another human being. And if you do invade that small gap of your personal space, you're aware of that. You know, if someone does that to you when you're on the, tra on the train or on the bus, you might think, yo, what's this dude doing? Is he trying to pickpocket me? And if women are doing that to you as well, they're aware of it and they're subconsciously and consciously doing it on purpose to close the proximity between the two of you so that you're nearer and body contact can ensue. So if you think a lady's invading your personal space, she's probably not trying to start a fight. She's probably not trying to steal your wallet, although she might be, be careful, all right? She probably likes you and that's another sign you should pick up on and make the move. Okay guys, so the third sign that a woman may be attracted to you, that she's feeling your vibes, has to be her general body language. Okay, so if a girl's standing like this, that means she's closed off. Same with her posture. If she's standing sideways away from you, or talking to you from the side, or gets her phone out during conversation, these are all very bad, bad body... These are all very, very bad body language traits. It shows she's closed off, she's not feeling you, she probably wants you to get the hell out of her face and you haven't got a chance, right? So if that's you, get out of here. But if it's not you and she's doing the following, then she's probably feeling you. If she's very open, arms all over the place, more gestures, as I said earlier, touching the hair, lots of animated movements, that shows she's feeling your vibe, she's stepping up her energy levels to reciprocate that energy you're giving her, and that's because she feels some attraction between you. So check for body language before you make the move. Open, happy, energetic body language nearly always symbolizes some kind of rapport, which means, go for it, Romeo, she could be yours. If she's all shut off and not feeling it, then Romeo, Hold that thought, because she's not feeling it. Again, the way that a woman makes eye contact is also very telling of her affections towards you. If she tends to maintain eye contact for a long time, sort of stare you into the eyes, look away, and have wide opened eyes, that is a short fire sign she likes you. Whereas if she looks away quickly, and whenever you try and make eye contact, she'll break it, that is saying, whoa, step away and she's not feeling you. So doughy eyed, wide opened eye contact. There's also a slight turn of the head which girls tend to do when they're finding a guy attractive, this kind of thing. It's all very coy and it's almost seductive, right? So if you're getting those vibes with the eye contact, then she could be yours, buddy. Go for it. Okay, so our next sign that a woman likes you has to be her responsiveness via text message, WhatsApp, over social media. I mean, if you don't know this, then dude, sort your life out, because you should do. If she's giving you one word answers, if she's taking an hour to reply or two days to reply, she's saying, whoa, 
I don't want to offend you, but I'm not interested romantically. You're in the friend zone or even less than that. I'm just being polite. So how can you tell if she is feeling you, right? Via text, social media. If she's replying all the time, if she's using lots of smiley faces, if she's bringing something, another element to the conversation, she's asking you your experience, she's telling jokes, she's investing in the conversation and she's replying rapidly. That is a definite sign that she likes you. If she's not doing all those things, then she's probably saying, look, I don't want to offend you, but take a step back because very soon I'm going to stop texting you back all together. Okay, so finally, our fifth and final sign that a woman may be attracted to you, that she likes you, she thinks you're a hot guy, has got to be general touching, all right? So body contact, okay? Often, guys will do this to women, and women will be really repelled. Oh, God, he's touching me. He's trying to, you know, oh, God, he's trying to, he's flirting with me, right? Men always do that because it's usually men who are the ones pursuing women, right? Our sociological gender roles say that we're the guys trying it, trying to take them the whole time. If a woman does this, it's very telling. When a man does it, much more obvious, he likes the girl. All guys like hot girls. It's not hard, right? It's not rocket science. Whereas when a woman likes you, she's much more coy. So if she does start to invade your personal space, when you tell a joke, she laughs. Or if you tease her, she says, oh, stop it. and gives you a little punch or something like that. General body contact. Laughing when you touch her. If there's something sad, she says, oh, and gives you a hug. Or pats you on the shoulder. All these little things are not a coincidence, right? She doesn't do that to a man she's not attracted to. Men do it to women all the time. Women do it much more exclusively to men they find attractive and who they feel comfortable with. So be aware of those signs. Is she making body contact in the situations I've just been through? If she is, there's a good chance that she could be attracted to you. Okay, gents, so that was it. Five signs that a woman may like you. She may be attracted to you. If you're reading those signs properly, then you too could have a hot date this Friday. You too. What do you mean you two? There's no bono here. What am I chatting shit about? You two, it's a ban. You two, I don't even have a date this Friday. Anyway, it's maybe that guy. I'm Ollie. Be sure to like, subscribe, leave us a comment, repost the video if I didn't chat too much shit, and there's plenty more fire coming from the camp very soon.